Aaron Burnett out front. Weeknights at 7, only on CNN. It could be the most disturbing Facebook post ever. A lifeless body photographed moments after the woman was shot to death in her home and posted with an apparent confession by her husband. Derek Medina wrote, I'm going to prison or death sentence for killing my wife. Love you guys. Miss you guys. Take care, Facebook people. You will see me in the news. Then Medina told his family. He just said that uh, his wife picked up a knife on him, they had a big fight and he shot her. And your son came to your house came this morning. house and all he said is I need to go to the police. I need to turn myself in. But there's no mention of Medina's Facebook post in the police report. The picture of his wife's body was up on his page for five hours with horrified Facebook friends sharing and commenting. This is different. It's almost as if everybody was in the room when the murder actually occurred and we're having conversations with this gentleman. This might be the first of its kind. Uh, I hate to say it, but I don't think it'll be the last of its kind. Facebook released a statement to CNN. The content was reported to us, and then we took action on the profile, removing the content and disabling the profile, and we reached out to law enforcement. Police have not released a possible motive, and Medina provided few clues in the digital trail he leaves behind. A photo posted hours earlier shows the family at dinner, all smiles. Medina's YouTube posts show him seemingly happy, throwing kicks and punches, and listening to a popular song. But ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Medina also promotes a series of self-help books he recently wrote. He wrote on EmotionalWriter.com. On his website, EmotionalWriter.com, he describes himself as a former professional athlete, coach, actor, and ghost hunter. He writes about his experiences with ghosts, aliens, and UFOs, and how your reactions can either save someone's life or kill an innocent person. Court records show that Medina and his wife divorced February last year, but remarried two and a half months later. One of Medina's books seems to mirror his experience. It's about a man named James who divorced and remarried the same person, found peace, and made peace. Medina promises to teach the reader to make your marriage and relationship with others better by understanding the meaning of life.